So I just got this Aqua Plus 10 foot long paddleboard and I wanna show you some of the attachments and what it comes with because I think it's actually better than I expected. So when you get this, it comes in a box, pretty concise and you actually have quite a few attachments. I'll show you in a minute, like you have this thing which is actually a guard for your legs so you don't lose your paddleboard if you fall off. You also have the paddle which easily snaps together with a simple click of a button basically. But you really, you have this really cool bag that you can store all of this stuff in. So if you wanna to go to the beach but you don't wanna carry all this junk, you can just fit it into the one backpack and carry it down to the beach in one swift go. So the actual paddleboard comes folded up like this and I'll show you how to inflate it and also put it back together like this so you can fit it into the backpack. But it's pretty simple. It just sort of unfolds like this. And I was surprised actually how big it was. I knew it was about 10 feet, but this thing is pretty big and pretty sturdy. I'm gonna have a lot of fun with this out on the water. So it's pretty compact. <laughs> I'm laying down here on it to show you just, I'm about five foot nine and I don't even take up half of it. So it's a pretty well put together thing. And the material is actually really, really thick and grippy. So when you stand on it, you should have no problem not slipping off. You also have the paddle right here, which I said is really easy to snap together. And you have sort of this bike pump contraption that you're gonna use to inflate the actual paddle board. Now, this is another attachment. This, like I said earlier, goes on your ankle so you don't lose the paddle board if you fall off. But it's pretty easy to put together. So the paddle board itself is actually about only a few feet long, but this is the pump. Works like a normal bike pump up and down, has a gauge on top so you can measure the pressure going into the pedal board. You have a simple tube that attaches to the top of it. And then all you gotta do is take the other end, neatly unscrew this little cap in the front that'll keep the air pressure in, put that in the hole like so, and then you just start pumping to inflate it. It takes about, um, took me about, couple minutes to inflate it because I wasn't sure how much pressure to put in. But like I said, this material is super grippy. Like you are not going to slip off this easily. And it is pretty water resistant. So I love that too. Overall, I think this is a pretty fire, fire paddleboard. And it easily folds together like this after it is deflated again. And all you have to do is kind of fold it over, make sure it's nice and tight so that it can neatly fit into the bag with the other attachments as well. And then once you get in the bag, you can just zip it up right here. It has adjustable straps for you so you can adjust it to whatever backpack you want. And then it kind of looks like this. So you have your bike pump and you have everything else you need. Hopefully you found this video helpful.